Here, we are going to solve a problem from Lilavati, a math text written 900 years ago by Bhaskara Acharya or Bhaskara II. Uh, I have taken this from a translation made by Henry Thomas Colebrook in 1817. The statement is, in a pleasant, spacious and elegant edifice with eight doors, constructed by a skillful architect as a palace for the lord of the land, tell me the permutations of apertures taken one, two, three, etc. So we have a building, a palace with eight doors and we want to find out how many ways those doors can be kept open or closed. Clearly this is a combinatorics problem and we'll be dealing with combinations rather than permutations because the order in which the doors are opened or maybe entered or exited is of no consequence. But rather than taking that conventional approach, we'll be uh, tackling it in a very different way. Maybe using binary numbers, uh, we'll try to understand uh, this process and then we'll see a neat trick from Lilavati. Let us try a direct approach here. So we'll be actually taking these eight doors and uh, opening and shutting them one by one and thereby creating some combinations. Let us see uh, what understanding we gain from that. So we'll start this process. So all the eight doors are closed to start with and I'll start you know, opening the first one, then I'll shut that and open the second one, then open the first one too and like that I'll keep creating combinations. But quickly I realize that there are just too many of these and there is all likelihood that I'll be missing some of these combinations while even if some of those get repeated I will not even notice them. So I need some way of you know ordering them so that if I follow that order I will not miss a single combination and none of them will be repeated either. For that I am going to take help of binary number system. See these doors have only two states 0 and 1 or open and shut. So I can code these uh, different configurations in terms of zeros and ones like this. For example here all doors are closed so each door is given the state 0 while if a door is open I will say it is in state 1 and like that we can keep generating these binary numbers successively and thereby we can ensure that we will not miss even a single combination. But of course binary numbers are not so easy to understand and their order. So we will convert them into decimal. So I'm going to take each of these binary digits and I'm going to convert it or multiply it uh, by its place value. So I'll multiply this with 1, then 2, 4, 8, 16, 32, 64 and 128. And when I add them up, I'm going to get a decimal number which is easy to track. So now let us go on again and create these different combinations. And since we are having decimal numbers to track them, so we can always make sure that uh, none of these states is missed or repeated. So if we keep doing that, then uh, we are going to get numbers from 0 to right now it is going up to 255. So in all 256 configurations. But that is hardly surprising. We have 8 doors and each has 2 states. So the total number of combinations is going to be eight, 2 into 2 into 2 8 times which is 2 raised to 8 or 256. So how does Bhaskara Acharya solve it in Lilavati? The trick in Lilavati says that first you write numbers 1 to 8 because we have 8 doors in a reverse manner. So like this 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2 and 1. And then just below them write them in the ascending order 1 to 8 again like this and then depending upon how many doors we are keeping open we have to take ratios. For example if you want to keep just one door open take the ratio of one number from here and one number from the lower sequence like this. So 8 upon 1, there are 8 ways of keeping a single door open out of 8. And what if you want uh, 2 doors open? In that case, take 2 numbers from the top sequence and 2 numbers from the, the first 2 numbers from the bottom sequence and take their ratio. So 8 into 7, 56 in the numerator divided by 2, it gives us 28 combinations. Like that, we can do 3 doors which will yield 56 combinations. Opening 4 doors is possible in 70 ways while 5 doors can be kept open in 56 ways and 6 doors have 28 combinations of 
opening them. And you will see this uh, number of these number of combinations uh, start increasing and then again they are tapering off, they are decreasing here. Uh, see here we have seven doors open which amounts to one door shut. And how many ways you can shut one door out of it? Of course eight ways. And finally how many ways can we open all the eight doors out of the eight doors that are there? Of course there is just one way. And if we add all these numbers 8 plus 28 plus 56 plus 70 so on we get the number 255. Then where is the last combination? The last combination is of course no doors are open all are shut. So that is how we get 256. So that's the trick given or that's the recipe given in Lilavati 900 years ago.